Hey guys, so today I have another limited quantity video and today I have 15 items. Um, I just want to say, okay, I haven't been claiming as much because I haven't been buying as much. I slowed down just a little bit because I have so much stuff coming in then I need to start making videos before I get new stuff. I mean, I have like here and there. Um, I did get, I believe four today so far. Um, I won four today so far and yesterday I got one and I only, um, I only bought one. So I got the only one that I bought. And then the day before that I got one, but I'm just not doing it like all day, every day, like I had been when I was getting like 10 a day. So, um, yeah, but it's super easy to claim. It's just a lot of work, I wanna say, like time, and takes a lot of time. It's really not work. All you gotta do is sit there and camp out on your phone um, how I claim. Okay. So the times are completely random. Now, if you haven't seen any of my previous videos, it's not top of the hour anymore. And it hasn't been for a while. I discovered that it's random. So what I do is like a couple minutes before the top of the hour, I, um, refresh my feed and I look and I see and I scroll down and see what limited quantity items there are. And I scroll down a little bit until I look at maybe like 10 to 15 of them. And then when the top of the hour hits, that's when I start refreshing every minute. Now, I use an app on an Android called Seconds app and it counts up the seconds like one to 50 um, and then zero. Um, one to, 50, one to 60, sorry, one to 60 um, for all the seconds of the minute. Now, um, the claim time is not on the exact minute. It's like four seconds afterwards. So I refresh four seconds after the minute, every minute until I see that all of the limited quantity stuff has changed. And that's when I claim. And I usually do two. I usually do two at a time. Um, I'll go and I'll claim one really quick and then I'll go back and look really quick and claim another. Um, sometimes I get both. Sometimes I only get one. Sometimes I get none, obviously. But um, yeah, so that's what I do. And I don't do it like, I only do it like a few hours in a day, if even sometimes only one. So, um, cause it does get tedious, but anyways, <laughs> let's get into this. And I, like I said before, I have 15 items. And if you're interested in purchasing any of these items, I will provide to the links to all of them in the description box down below. All you need to do is click on them and buy them. All right. So let's get into it. The first item. I would have paid $35 for this and I only paid 79 cents Ugh. and they are thigh high suede blue boots with a wedge heel and they've got this like lace detailing at the top. Now these are cute. They look cute. Um, I don't know if I'm going to keep them or not because I have no idea where I'd wear these to because these are not my style, but I thought they were so cute and I claimed them. So I don't know. I might wear them. I might not. We'll see. All right. Moving on. Okay. I pay, I would have paid $77 for this and I only paid 79 cents. And this is really neat. This is a set of paints. It's like watercolors, I think. Um, and it says Paul Rubens is the company name. And it's got this little man logo. A guy in a hat. I don't know. I feel like that's some famous painter or something. Want to be like Picasso or something like that. I don't know. Um, all right. So here is the little case and then it opens up 
like that. There is a color sheet in here. I don't know what all that means because I don't think there's that many paints in there. And then there's this and it's all, okay. Now this tells me what the color names are. If you can see, it tells them in Chinese and in English. So it says pearl silver white, pearl platinum, flash yellow, blah, blah, blah. And here are, yeah, see it? Cause it doesn't say it on here, but here are the colors. Now these are covered up. Let me see if I can like remove this and remove the little, thing to actually show you what a real color looks like without the little there we go so this is like a pearly color obviously it says pearl silver white now these are all like glittery pearly kind of colors and these the stickers that are over top of them are like holographic, so I'm not sure if they're exactly that color, but they're pretty close. But I just thought this was really neat. Um, my daughter, Brooklyn, is really into art and painting and all that, so I thought this would be perfect for her. It doesn't come with any brushes. This is just the paint, and it comes with this thing which I thought was really neat this kind of looks like um the, the wipes that are that come with glasses to wipe glass off so I'm gonna keep that as well because that's really neat and that has the logo on it and everything so that is that then okay this I would have paid $23 for I only paid 79 cents and this is, the box got super crushed, but this is a microphone and it's Bluetooth. So it's wireless and I don't think it takes batteries. No, it's USB. You, I guess you just plug it in to charge it. It doesn't come with the USB charger, but here's the instructions. Um, and then it has all these buttons. This is the play pause. So I guess this is like a karaoke microphone because I think you can play music because here's a speaker right here. You can play music out of this and sing along to it. So that's really cool. Remix button, a mic only button. Oh no, mic volume, remix. Next, previous scan, the volume and record. So that is really, really neat. I'm gonna have to look and look at all the features and all that stuff. I haven't tried it yet, obviously, but that's really neat. I like that. All right, next up, I would have paid $46 for this. I only paid 79 cents. And this is like a cosplay costume. It was advertised as a medieval monk costume and it came with, it came in four or five colors. I should have gotten white, but I just kind of clicked, click, clicked and I clicked on like navy blue. So here's the hood. And I guess this goes under the robe part and this is the robe part so I don't know if we're gonna keep this I got it an extra large by the way I don't know if we're gonna keep this I don't know if my husband's gonna want it and then it comes with a rope to fasten it but I might sell it for like a Halloween costume or something like that. Um, but yeah. All right, next up, I would have paid $32 for this. I only paid 79 cents. This I'm definitely going to sell because <laughs> I don't have a baby anymore. 
but this is i'm just gonna keep it in the in the pack so that it stays brand new and fresh um this is a thing as you can see it has these things on the end that clip onto um like a car seat or a bassinet this is too small for a crib but it says easy to clip on your baby's buggy which is the stroller um it's got soft hanging toys which these things a little heart with a squeaker um and a love lovely bunny it says <laughs> but as you can see it's got the bunny the heart it does squeak and then the soft little bird toy that's neat all right next up what is this oh i would have paid 43 dollars for this i only paid 79 cents and this is which i already have one of these so i might just sell this one because i think i have the exact same one like to the t exact same one and this is a nail drill Here's the drill part. Uh, yeah, I have the exact same one. These are the drill bits because I have the same drill bits. And this thing, I'm pretty sure I have this in purple as well. Or mine might be pink. I don't know. But this is where you rest your um, file on. But yeah, and then it comes with the instructions. And I paid paid a little less for mine because I had um, coupon deals and I bought it on AliExpress so I didn't pay shipping and I also shopped around to find the cheapest price although that was like a year and a half ago I believe that I did that so it's probably the link's probably not there anymore um but yeah if you're wondering this works well I also bought since these are metal I bought ceramic um drill bits for it because I was told that the ceramic work better than the metal keep that in mind but yeah that is really neat excited about that next up I would have paid $40 for this I only paid 79 cents and these are sheets I think no duvet cover I believe I'm not going to um unwrap it or anything but this is the pattern it's just um gray and it comes with I believe two pillowcases yep so it's the duvet cover and two pillowcases I believe or it's a sheet you know what honestly I think this is a sheet yeah I'm pretty sure this is a sheet because I don't see any zipper. Yep, because here's the edges. Okay, so this is a sheet set. <laughs> this is a sheet and two pillowcases. So that is really nice. Um, and it's soft, really soft. Um, the feel, the quality of it is really nice. And yeah, so I'm probably gonna keep that. You can always use sheets, right? All right, and something fell out. Oh, they gave me a little, welcome to my shop. <laughs> they gave me a little pendant or something and it says love on it. That I didn't pay for and it's like wood. Ooh, dropped it. It says love on one side and a more on the other side. All right, next up, I would have paid $56 for this. I only paid 79 cents and I have used this several times and I love it. This is a speaker, a Bluetooth speaker and it's so loud. I love it. Um, I have a Bluetooth speaker that I use in my shower, one that like 
clips onto the wall, like suction cups onto the wall. The suction cup broke and I've just been kind of like resting it on where like my shampoos and stuff are, but it doesn't get very loud. This gets so loud and I love it. I just put it like far from my shower, like the opposite end of my shower, um, on the top of my like cabinets and that's where it plays and it is phenomenal. It comes with the charging port and this thing, which actually clips onto here and then you can like clip it onto something and have it hang. Although it's pretty heavy, not that heavy, but I mean, it's pretty big and bulky, so I don't know if I'd want it hanging. But here is where you charge it. And it also has an aux cord and a, what do you call it? A USB port. On this side, it's got this button, which turns it on. Bluetooth mode connected. That's how loud it gets. And imagine that with music, which I'm not gonna play music because <laughs> copyrights, but um, <laughs> yeah, it's connected right now to my Bluetooth. And then this is the play pause button. So, um, and it's the answer phone button. Like if your phone's ringing, you can answer your phone with it. To turn it off and on, you hold it down. To press play and pause, you just click it. Um, and to answer your phone, you just click it. Now this is the search like next, next track or back track button. Um, to use those, you just click once. Uh, the volume, this is volume down and volume up. To use those, you just hold them down and then they'll go up or down. So turn it off. Turn it off. And here is the instructions and I love it. I love it. I've used it multiple times and best thing I've ever had. <laughs> best speaker I've ever had. All right, next up, I would have paid $37 for this. I only paid 79 cents. And this was advertised as a a man fanny pack, but you don't really, you put it like on your hip, but in the back, this clips around your waist, I'm guessing. And then this part clips around your leg. And then you've got this zipper compartment right here. And this zipper compartment up here. And then this opens up and then you have a compartment in here with, this comes out, I don't know. And then you can seal it like, boop. Then this part opens up into a zipper. There's a pocket up here. And then there's one pocket on this side and another little pocket on this side. So a lot of compartments. There's not any in the back. But yeah, just a lot of compartments, a lot of space, really nice. Next up, I would have paid $33 for this. I only paid 75 cents. Now this is not something I would pay $33 for, but I would pay 79 cents. So this is a maxi dress, but it's jean style, jean material. The material is nice and soft. I like that, but it's just a maxi. And I'll show you, um, I'll show you what it looks like. And I'm also, I'll, I'll also show you um, right after this what that monk costume looks like, because I know you didn't get the full effect of what it looks like just by seeing it in my hands.
All right, so that's the dress, and then the next one was the monk costume. But yeah, I think this is really cute. I got it in a medium, and I can't wait to wear it once the weather's not so hot, because obviously it's long, and it's going to make me sweat if I wear it now. Next up, I would have paid $38 for this. I only paid $0.79. Cents. And this is, okay, okay, okay. This is like a pantsuit kind of thing. Hate the material already. Would not pay $33 for this, let me tell you that. Or however much it said it was. Did I say 33? I don't know. But it's that nasty, like, I don't know, material. Then up here is all laced. It is pretty up top. I don't know how this is gonna look on, but I will show you a picture of what it is supposed to look like. Really cute in the picture. Not so cute looking at it in person, although I haven't seen it on me, so I don't know. Um, Maybe I'll tell you after I try it on in the comments whether or not it's um, decent, but from the looks of it, it's not very great quality. All right, next up, I would have paid $22 for this. I only paid 79 cents. And these are quilting squares. I think it's a pack of like 50 or 75 or something like that. Let me take them out and I'll show you a few of the patterns. Here's like Easter one, leaves with flowers, a whole bunch of flowers, some cute little bunnies, um, more flowers, more flowers, just a whole bunch of flowers. Most of these are flowers as I'm going through them, but yeah. Lots and lots of designs. My dad's girlfriend sews, so um, I'm gonna see if she wants these because I have no use for them. Either that or I'm probably gonna sell them if she doesn't, but she did take the snaps that I got in a couple videos ago, so, and she really liked those. So next up, <laughs> this one's funny. Okay, I, pay, I would have paid $23 for this. I only paid 79 cents. And this is what I like to call, actually I won't say it on here because people might get offended, <laughs> but it's one of those bob wigs. It's a wig. Here's the mesh, which I'm not going to use that right now, but this is a bob, blonde bob wig. And of course, I messed that up. I can't get it open. Okay. So the zip. The Ziploc thing broke on this. Let's try it on. Okay, so <laughs> I didn't put my hair up or anything. This is what it looks like. It's actually not bad quality. Um, the hair is really silky and soft as well. Um, it does say it's synthetic, I believe. It says 90% not, oh, that's that part. I don't know if it's synthetic or not. I think it is because a human hair one would be a lot more expensive, but that's what it looks like. And it comes with this piece to put your hair in so that your hair is not falling down and getting in the way. This is the wig cap. But yeah. It's actually not bad quality. It's actually pretty nice quality. Um, just not my style. So <laughs> that is not my haircut at all. So yeah, that's that. And last but not least, ugh, I would have paid $68 for this. I only paid 79 cents. And yes, it is an instrument. Oof. And this is not a guitar. 
It is a violin. And I thought this would be really neat um, since Brooklyn is allowed to start an instrument this year that she could do the violin. And we did, um, whoops, we did tighten the strings. We did tighten the bow and we did rosin it so that it does. Oh, that untightened a little bit so that it does um, make a noise. Obviously, I don't know how to play, and obviously, it's not tuned, but <laughs> it does work. Now, it's not perfect. It's not perfect quality. This is the material. It's pretty lightweight. Excuse my dogs, but that's what this looks like. Um, it is basically a child's violin. I would not use it for professional use. I would not use it if... <laughs> You are looking to, um, I don't know, join a symphony or something like that. So, and here's the bow. It's cheaply made. Obviously the hairs um, snap, this and that. Um, you can always replace the bow, but it works um, for the time being, so. And then here is the case. It's got like a velvet inside, like velour feeling and then just this material on the outside with a pocket. Now, there is something in that pocket. I believe that's the rosin. Yes. And this is the little rosin piece. As you can see, we've used it. And yeah, that is everything. Like I said in the beginning of this video, if you're interested in purchasing any, any of these items, the links will be provided in the description box down below. I can't talk. <laughs> and that's everything. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up, leave a comment, and if you haven't already, please subscribe. Thank you for watching and have an awesome day. Bye.